part of my pink dogwood tree is struggling, while one main branch that gets the most sun is doing great. I've had a local arborist look at it, and he said there is no disease, but it's obvious based on this year's spring blooms that there's some kind of problem. Any thoughts? And this is Carol from Greensboro, North Carolina. So what do you think about that? What, what, what comes to mind? Uh, I'm mystified. <laughs> <laughs> You're mystified? Okay. Yeah, so if you have one main branch that gets the sun, uh, it's doing great, she says. So this is what I'm thinking. Number one, could it be winter injury? Okay, first thing that came to mind, right? Second thing is this, if that plant is already stressed, or the dogwood tree is already stressed, the dogwood bore may have gotten into that wood, mm. okay? And it disrupts the flow of water and nutrients to the upper canopy, which causes branches to die. It could cause the tree to die. Mm -hmm. So I would call a local arborist, have them come out and just see if there are little bore holes sure. there, right? Look for a little frass on the ground uh, because I think that might be the culprit. I think so, right? Because again, you have yeah. one that's doing pretty good, but then you have the other that's not, not doing so well, so it's stressed. Mm -hmm. Dogwood bores are secondary pest. Right, and the photograph, I was, I was curious about that because it was lower branches, mm -hmm. and dogwoods like shade. They like right? shade. So, you know, that right. like shade. surprising. I'll right. bet you're right. There were some trees, of course, in the background. You can tell whether it was getting enough shade, you know, mm -hmm. from those trees or not, but it's stressed. And of course, anytime I think about stress, I think about secondary pests, mm -hmm. which could be a bore, you know, which can, again, disrupt the flow of nutrients and water to the upper canopy. So that may be an issue there. And of course, you know, there are shallow rooted, you know, trees and things like that. So you have to make sure it's mulched and things like mm -hmm. that. Make sure it gets enough moisture. Um, but two, I was curious about the winter, of course, you know, because there'd be a little bit of injury there. Mm -hmm. uh, but at the end of the day, it's stress, right? So some kind of sure. stress, yeah, secondary pest can be a problem. All right. So I hope that helps you out, Ms. Carroll. Yeah. So I would, yeah, again, contact the local arborist, have them to come out and see if there could be evidence a dog will bore. Thanks for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed. To subscribe, click below.